In the Critical Care Mailbag, we tackled one of the biggest papers of the year, perhaps the most game-changing article that we have looked at in a couple of years. Mike and Sanjay reviewed on EMA as well. This is the pre-oxy study. This was a randomized control trial comparing non-rebreather versus BiPAP for pre-oxygenation prior to intubation. What they found was a reduction in severe hypoxemic events by 50%. 18.5% all the way down to about 9%, giving a number needed to treat of 10. So what we did in this particular segment was talk to Weingart about how this probably should be our standard operating procedure based on the best evidence that we have and how to actually get it done. I will say that the big key here is not just to read the article, see that it makes a difference, want to do it, but actually sit down with your respiratory therapist, with your department, with your nursing, and come up with a plan to actually make it happen. But I think based on what we have right now, based on this fantastic article, pre-oxygenating patients prior to intubation with non-invasive ventilation should be our standard approach.